Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to another video. Today, we have a new character coming out. Woo, finally. Honkai Star Rail has officially released their latest character. I'm sure you've already seen the thumbnail and the title. So why don't we just get in to talking about her. Honkai Star Rail officially released the latest character today in Robin, which I'm very excited about. However, this does put into question a lot of things that happen in the story. We're going to see that she is a Harmony physical character, which is super interesting because we already have a couple of those or one of them to be more specific. But when they put this out, I was just really confused because I had just presumed that she was kind of uh, dead, to be honest. I put out a tweet and I said, uh, so, uh, is she dead or not? Which I'm still not sure about to this date. I'm not sure if she is dead or not, but I'm going to hope that she isn't because I do like her design. I did have a gut feeling that they wouldn't let a character design as gorgeous as this one go to waste because they made such a good design for her. Just to kill her off would be really weird. And that's the same reason I think that we're probably going to see Firefly coming back as well. That's just a gut feeling. I cannot say for sure. But I think we may be seeing Firefly either in this update or the next one. I don't know. We'll find out either today or tomorrow because we're still getting, I believe, two more character releases. So you guys can expect more character videos from me coming soon where we talk about all the latest characters. So make sure to subscribe. And you know what else was really funny about this release is... Earlier today, somebody sent me a clip from my very first episode of Hunt Only, where I say, do Harmony and I'll, only. I'll just let the clip speak for itself. And who knows, maybe we'll do Harmony Only if we reach 100,000 subscribers. Yeah, I said that. And, and you see how close we are. And I'm thinking maybe if we reach 100,000 by the time of Robin's release, which, what does that give me, a month, maybe two months? Because we have the Acheron release and then Abitrine. I'm thinking we might have to do Harmony only. You know, I would have to do three accounts. Which would be really stressful. But it does sound kind of fun to be honest. But I'm not sure. If you guys want to see that, make sure to let me know in the comments below. But anyways, back to Robin. Let's talk more on her character. We got a little off track there. So Physical Harmony is a really interesting typing. And if we compare her to the rest of the Harmony characters in the game... So what do we have? Yukong, Tingyun, Hanya, Asta, Ronmei, Bronya, Sparkle. I'm hoping that she'll be on the level of Ronmei and Sparkle is what I'm hoping. Because obviously those two 5 stars are absolutely broken. And if Robin can't live up to their level, I'm not sure how usable she will really be. One thing that does make me really sad about Robin's release is that Hanya is going to become like completely and utterly irrelevant. I actually feel so bad for Hanya. First, we had Sparkle's release, which already kind of put her in the grave since Sparkle is just a better skill point manager than she is. But it's like, oh, well, she's physical. So at least we can use her when we need the physical weakness, right? No, not anymore. <laughs> because we have Robin now. <laughs> so, so Hanya has gone from here when she came out to like here. I don't uh, all the way down there. Below the face cam levels of mediocre. <laughs> but you know what? I'm happy for Robin. I actually really enjoy her aesthetic. And I feel like she fits the Harmony persona really well. I feel like her aesthetic really fits the Harmony symbolism a lot. Obviously, Penacony is the kind of ideal of Harmony. I actually don't even know that. I think Penacony at the end of it, we're going to get Harmony Trailblazer, right? Okay, I'm not actually sure on that. I'm, I shouldn't speak on that yet. But yeah, I think the Harmony fits her well. I love her design. Her outfit is kind of clean, I'm not going to lie. Although it still has the shoulder thing, which like every other Hoyoverse character in the game, I'm telling you, somebody at Hoyoverse has a shoulder fetish. And if you don't believe me, go look at every single character they designed. I guarantee you at least 70% of them have exposed shoulders. Prove me wrong. We are probably going to be learning more about her in the 2.1 special program, which is coming up for um, March 16th. So that is in one, two, three, four days. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for that. Hopefully, we're going to learn a lot about her character, get a new addition to the story where we may see Robin make a return. We'll see. I, I'm still not 100% convinced that she's alive. 
I'll be honest, I did not trust Avertreen and Black Swan saying that these characters were dead. Because if you guys remember, after Firefly's death, they spoke like she was dead. Acheron gave her little flowers and said, I'll see you in the next life or whatever she said. I can't exactly remember the quote. But they really, really spoke about it as if she was dead. The, you could tell the writers really wanted you to have the opinion that they were dead. That was kind of the vibe they were trying to give off with Firefly's death. However, both of these characters died in the dream world. And we've really got no verification if dying in the dream world means dying in real life. Again, just based on what the characters were saying, I assumed dying in the dream world meant dying in real life. But honestly, I'm still not 100% sure. Her brother really sold it like she was dead when Sparkle transformed and pretended to be Robin. Her brother really sold it as if Robin was dead and that Sparkle was trying to be the trickster that she was. You know, classic Sparkle tings and whatnot. But either way, I'm excited for her. I hope that she's coming back for the story. I'm excited they didn't let her kit go to waste. I'm really excited that they didn't let her design go to waste. And I'm also excited to see what other characters we get in the next two days. I'm hoping for Firefly for one. I'm hoping for Firefly definitely. For the second one, ooh. Well, we have Acheron, we have Avatrine. Sam maybe? Sam could be a good shout. We may see somebody new. Oh boy. I mean, Sam's the only one we don't have yet, right? Let me check your Dreamscape pass. Who do we not have yet? Ooh, Avatrine's coming out. We have Black Swan. We have Sparkle. Akron's coming out. Firefly, I think, is going to come out. Misha is already out. We know Robin's coming out. Probably Sam. Or Sunday. I forgot about Sunday. Okay. So it's probably going to be Robin, Firefly. Firefly looks like a four star, to be honest. And then either Sam or Sunday. Either Sam or Sunday. I don't know which one we'll see. I want to say probably Sunday, but we're going to have to wait and see. For right now, though, that's going to be all for me. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'm going to see you all when Hoyoverse drops their next character. Peace.